So I get these questions all the time. How do you grow your clientele, your landscaping business, your lawn care business? How do you get the phone ringing off the hook so you can go full time in your business or so you can, you know, just have more clients, a full schedule, make more money and not worry about it anymore. Um, to me, it seems like the easiest thing in the world only because of studying marketing and watching it happen in my my actual business and the businesses of hundreds of other people that I know personally, I see this happen. So the proof and the data shows that if you do A, B, and C, X, Y, and Z will happen. It's it's just a principle. Now this is also coming from a guy who was flat broke, stuck in a dead end job for way too long, not even believing I could get my own small business off the ground. And I spent several years being angry that I didn't do it sooner. So here's how you market your lawn care landscaping business. Here's how you advertise to get more leads. But before I talk about that, I wanna say there's this kind of barrier. It's like a self-limiting belief. You have these blinders up that you can feel or think that it's outside of your control. So how do, how do you get more work? How do you get more jobs? How do you get more clients? Like how do you do that? But the truth is it's so freaking inside of your control and your area your area of influence that it's actually very simple. Imagine that there's neighborhoods upon neighborhoods upon neighborhoods and thousands and thousands of people. They, they need their property maintained. They need their lawn cut. Their edging is overgrown. They need this thing dug out. They need mulch. There's so much work out there that it's overwhelming, truthfully. And they're looking out and they're just, they're looking for somebody who's reliable, somebody who's dependable, somebody that they can have a long-term relationship with. They're begging to write you a check. They're begging to give you money. They, they're holding the money out. They're basically standing out by their mailboxes saying, please, somebody. If you just, you have business cards, you can find a local graphic designer. <laughs> you don't want, <laughs> okay, never mind. Uh, my sister-in-law is a professional graphic designer and she's so swamped she can't take on any more business but if she's available I'll let you know go on 99designs.com go on fiverr.com go on upwork.com or go to a local graphic design and print shop get a logo made put your services on the back huge phone number on the back of your shirts get business cards I mean magnets made for the sides of your truck I have aluminum doors so I can't do it but I have huge signs right here with a phone number Get bandit signs made that you stick in the ground and put them at the entrances of the subdivisions that you want to work in until they bitch at you and forcefully remove them and say, if you do that again, we are going to be in trouble. Do it again. Bandit signs. Magnets. If you have a lawn care trailer, put a huge one of these on the back of your trailer with your, your flyer. Go on Craigslist and pay five bucks a day. Do it, do it four times a week. It's only 20 bucks a month and post lawn care and landscaping. Go on Facebook and create a Facebook page. Go on Facebook Marketplace and post it, right? Go on the top 50 local uh, search engine authority domain websites and create citations, which means a Yelp, Yahoo, Bing. Uh, there's one for Google My Business, Angie's List. Any, any place that will let you create a free profile and upload your logo, a bio, a bi a biography about your business, list of services, pricing, phone number, and create a link and start linking all that stuff back to your website. If you don't have a website, go on squarespace.com or Wix or Weebly or Kajabi or there, there's a million of them. Even uh, Google My Business will let you create a free website and start to build all that out. So spend, brew yourself a pot of coffee. Sit down in the evening, even if it takes you till midnight, build a website, start linking. You know how you see on the bottom of your website the little tiny uh, social media icons for Facebook and Twitter and Instagram? Go and create those for your business and then link them because what you're doing is you're creating backlinks for your business. The more of those backlinks you have going on in the internet and the more of those things you have offline in the real world all over the place, you become a resounding gong that's saying, I'm in business, I'm in business. And the more people that see that you're in business and that you're available for hire online and offline, and the more word of mouth spreads around, and the more people that you go and do work for, you ask, can you please give me a well-worded review on Google or Facebook? The more of that stuff you have going on, it, it, it generates a snowball effect that starts out really small, but I'm telling you, within a year, this thing can get going so much 
that now your conversation changes. Now you're overwhelmed because you have so many people requesting for your work and your services that you're having a panic attack and you, you, you have a stack of checks, you got like $14,000 in checks and you don't even have time to cash them. That's literally what happens to so many guys that I meet at the GIE Expo. If you click the link in the description below, you can get 50% off, off your tickets to the GIE Expo. They gave me a special link and I make a couple bucks off of it. But you get 50% off, man. Click the link in the description below. Well, actually, don't do that because the YouTube algorithm is going to hurt me if you click off. Don't do that. Go find me on Instagram and then do it there. But, but anyways, I'm serious here. I meet so many guys at these live events that they have the same exact fears and the same exact aspirations. And when they finally get so sick and tired of just plateauing, they just, you get to this point where you finally just take the leap because you're just sick and tired of not having change happen. So you say, when the pain of staying the same gets worse than the pain of changing, you'll change. And another thing, I had this roommate, this is the last thing I'm going to say. When I, I was younger and I was broke and before I got married and I was stuck in a dead-end job, I was very rebellious. I had this roommate. He was older than me. He was a recovering addict and he had his shit together now and he was going for his master's degree and we're roommates and I'm like trying to get out of my room and leave and he puts his hand up on the wall his name was Dave you've heard me talk about Dave he puts his hand up on the wall like this and he stops me he blocks me and I stop and I was like what's going on I was a little bit younger he says you gotta he says you gotta stop bucking the system Falcus I said what and he was right I was like no I see that you're bucking the system and you're gonna have a long, hard road if you don't stop bucking the system. And even though I didn't, I bucked to what he said, I went to bed and I thought about that. So what I'm talking about is modeling. Just look around at what these other guys that are doing that seems to be working, go online, right? Like ClickFunnels, you can ethically rip off what other people are doing just go look at their websites, look at their reviews, look at what other people are saying and try to cross that like blood brain barrier of getting out of your own head and start seeing it for what it really is. Seeing that you can kind of game the system by getting good at marketing and putting your stuff all over the place and, and your customers and people that don't even know you yet will start to perceive you as a much bigger outfit than you actually are. You can create and generate all this reciprocity and all this uh, look of professionalism all over the internet and it's just you and a guy in a truck that's what you want to do you want to lean everything so much in your favor to now where you have this amazing problem that your phone's ringing off the hook and your stress is a new stress it's that you were trying to get to all these jobs on time anyways i gotta go hit me up text if you want to get my free pdf download the seven steps to marketing your business online is totally free. It's a fully comprehensive guide that you can get on your smartphone right now. Text the word UNTRAPPED to 31996. So take out your phone and go to Compose New Message to 31996 and then text the word UNTRAPPED. It'll trigger a prompt and then you can get the free PDF download. All right, see you in the next video. Make sure you smash the subscribe button down.